content vlogs extra like behind the scenes type stuff and like you're like why isn't jace uploading animation you can go on my second channel and see what i'm doing you see what i'm saying so i would recommend subscribing to that second channel right now especially if you like you know like i said yeah, you think i'll be a good content, animator me, vlogs like, school start vlogs, anime, like, football games i have a bunch of ideas a bunch yeah, of content I mean, a ready good to go i'm just gonna post it as soon as i can but yeah uh go look up chicago that, like, right starter pack anyway. on you youtube chicago starter pack I don't see it. I don't see it. Starter packs for different kids in school. I guarantee you, you just know a motherfucker like this. Don't you hate them? Let me know if you hate any of these people. And if you are any of these people in this video, let's go. First, let's start it off with the most obvious one of them all, the Hot Cheeto Girl. Emphasis on the damn curly ass edges. Don't forget the perfume they spray every 10 minutes. Can't forget nah, the nigga emphasis. not this, bro. It's not on YouTube, bro. Like, what are you talking about, bro? It's not on YouTube. Let me let me search up on fucking Google, bro. It's probably on Google, gang. It's probably on Google, bro. The Chicago Starter Pack. So I need dreads, white Air Forces, a gun, and let's just GP. This is Chicago Starter Pack? This is what you talking about? <laughs> Nigga. I mostly got all this shit already. Just not the dreads. And not this. I got a gun, but not this type of gun. I don't got that shit. I don't got that little. I don't got that little fucking goddamn. They missing the Hellcat. <laughs> Nigga said they missing a the Hellcat. It's not my gun though. Well, enjoy the video. Bye. So for me personally, when not I'm chilling and walking to my shit. next class, and I see a baddie, I mean like shorty fine, and I look at her like damn, and I keep it pushing, and then the next day, the same location, same hallway, same time, I see her, same thing as yesterday, damn, she bad. Skip to day four oh, of this process, I'm like, oh yeah, she my hallway hellcat. crush on, bro. And I be like, why so? Why so many people gotta get in a Hellcat? Like, is Hellcat fire or some shit? I don't think I'm going to get a Hellcat, bro. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah, she bad, but I ain't going to talk to her or try none because when it comes to my hallway crushes personally, like with me, it's just like I'm acknowledging the fact that she's bad and moving on. Like, I won't ever try I anything, especially when it comes down to a girl I think that is pretty or attractive or whatever. Yeah. Like, I will make direct eye contact with them. Like, I'm going to look her straight in her face and she look back at me. I'm going to hold eye contact for like two seconds and then keep it pushing. Like I said, I'm not facts. pursuing that. Facts, facts, facts. Bro, I always used to do this shit, bro. I would look at a girl in the hallway, bro, and never talk to him, bro. Never. Never, bro. Never. <clears throat> I never really talked to him, bro. <clears throat> bro, Hellcat is lit, nigga. Bro, how is Hellcat lit, bro? And I'm not even the type to go up to girls in the first place. Like, I'd rather them approach me if they want to approach me. You see what I'm saying? But, like, two weeks ago, I was tweaking out this day. I was moving different. And I was walking back from lunch with my friend. And while I was walking, I dead was, like, on a scouting mission. Like, I mean, looking through the crowds of people. As a, you pussy, yeah, right, they walked by. And no glaze, but I saw probably one of the most attractive girls I've seen in a minute. Anyway, I saw her. I looked at her. I liked what I saw. And like I said, I like making direct eye contact with them. So I looked right at her. And then she looked right at me. And we held eye contact for like a minute and i was thinking damn and then i turned back around to look away from her and walked like seven more footsteps and i was like i'm gonna hit a look back like i had to come on bro like i had to look one more time so i turned around to see her one more time and she was still looking at me gang and i was dead and not expecting that whatsoever so when i saw her looking i whipped my head back really quickly because shorty had me on a trance or something i don't know had me feeling a little <laughs> silly and Yo. after i looked away i had a real life quick time event and the options were to go get her number or something or keep it pushing but it was dead different this time because afterward i was like i sold the bag like i don't see girls like her every day in my school like that it was literally the first time i've ever seen her before in the first place so i was like okay tomorrow i'm gonna hopefully see her walking back from lunch and i would do this by taking the exact same route and walking the exact same speed and basically doing everything exactly the same so i can have that chance encounter and just experience it one more time you feel me and then do what i gotta do now i know that sounds od but bro i don't know i was on a main mission and, and i was gonna complete it so the next day during lunch i was at this volleyball game so i didn't end up, i didn't end up seeing her on my route because it was completely changed so cut to the next day i'm walking one of my friends back from lunch and i'm in the hallway where i saw her two days ago at this point and i i never let an opportunity pass me bro that's how you gotta live life now bro i gotta live life like that now bro i used to love opportunity pass me bro i can't do that shit no more bro you gotta like fucking you not know saying bro 
gotta fucking take every opportunity, man. After a big group of people went by and I didn't see her, I was like, damn, it is what it is. And while thinking that mid-sentence, in my mind, I saw her and her friend walking. And I looked at her and she looked at me. And with no hesitation, I walked up to her with my phone already in my hand because you know what it is with me. And I said, can I get your Insta? And she was like, I don't have Insta, but you got my number. And with zero hesitation, once again, I said, bet. Pull out my contacts, put her number on my phone. And she also she had a cool ass name, but anyway, I got her number. I said, nice meeting you. And shook her hand like a gentleman and walked away to my friend shit, who my was boy, yelling know, the Rizzler in the middle of the hallway. But this is like the first and only time that I've approached her. The Rizzler? Oh, this nigga, oh, this nigga young as shit. Because Riz was not even a thing when I was in school, bro. Riz was not even a thing when I was in school, bro. That shit crazy. Riz was not a thing when the I was girl. in school. So I'm like one for one, but I still rather a girl come up to me. I just had to make a different decision for this certain girl, you feel me? Because she bad, like, you know what I'm saying? She bad. But let's get to the OD stuff. Now, I don't know if it's just me, but when I see a girl, right, maybe more than once in a certain hallway, see her go to her class or something, you know, and know where she's going to be, I would dead YouTube sometimes. Now, hear me out when I say sometimes. You just, you just had to have, like, talk. Like, it wasn't Riz. It wasn't called Riz. It was like... You know how to talk to girls. It wasn't no word for it. Like, I don't think it was no word for it. Flirting? It wasn't no word for it. That's why I read the perfect word. Like, nigga, like, it was no words for, word for that shit, bro. I would sometimes change my entire walking route just to see that girl again. Now, I know that's OD and it sounds crazy. I'm not the only one, bro. I promise you. Like, you there's plenty of people game? who I know. Mm -hmm. Games, yeah, I forgot going on side yeah, quests, walking to the opposite side of the building in the school just to see or talk to one girl. And you, so you can't say nothing about me slightly. Ch but I was ugly and like I was ugly. I was ugly in middle school, so I didn't really get that much bitches. I had like three. I had like I had like got three bitches my whole middle school fucking career, bro. I ain't gonna count, bro. I was ugly as shit. Changing my route just to get it under glance, you know what I'm saying? Like, once I have the location of my classes memorized, I can take any route to get to my class and not be late. So, it's fine if I take a left instead of a right this time. And then, you know, while I'm taking that left, I just happen to run into this one girl I saw in the hallway like 35 minutes ago. You know, I look at her, she looks at me, whatever, whatever, you feel me? If, if it happens, it happens. It's just coincidence, obviously. I didn't like plan that out or anything. And then sometimes, me personally, I do this. Whenever I was spitting game, nigga always would shout my boy spitting game. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. That, that nigga's L man and shit. <laughs> that nigga L man and shit. That remind me of that Duke video, bro. That remind me of that Duke video. Where's that? Where the fuck is that? Where the fuck is it at? Here's a go. Oh, I seen it. Never mind. This shit. This shit. This shit. This shit. This shit. This shit. This shit right here. Come on, turn. Let's fucking raise right here. Yo, bro, this is the funniest shit I ever seen. <laughs> nigga says that I spoke, that's some spoken ribs right there, bro. <laughs> Why this nigga's talking to a bitch, bro? That's crazy as fuck, bro. That's crazy as shit. Whenever I was spitting game, a nigga would always, yeah, bro. It's in the complete opposite nah, context, doing the like most to avoid point, a girl. Bro. Which I've already had to do this year, but that's a different story for a whole man, different bro. time. And back to one of the things I said earlier about me. When I comes to, like, a hallway crush, it's nothing I'm going to pursue. It's just, like, a girl I might think is attractive or cute or pretty or whatever. I might look at her. Now, this look is very important. I hit her with the, the light skin. Sin City wasn't made for you, know what I'm saying? This look... <laughs> <laughs> look is very important because say they look at you back right you make eye contact you hold eye contact or whatever they recognize your face so the next time when you accidentally run into them quotations on accidentally you can hit that same look and they're gonna look at you again you know what i'm saying you get in our head she start thinking about you but this eye contact has to be perfect like, you can't just be like staring at somebody like a crazy person like if especially if you look weird bro you just it's, it's gonna ruin the whole thing because like say some girl or whoever your hallway crush is or whatever is walking by and you're just staring at the person and you're just like dead ass just but low key if i knew a bitch was a hoe and she liked me and shit i was just making contact and smile and walk away but low key if i knew a bitch was a hoe and she liked me shit i would just make eye contact and smile and walk away i'd be living them hella confused oh i see what you're saying
So you saying and a bitch like you, you would just walk away? Bro, it was this one girl in fucking fucking high school, ninth grade, bro. She just kept calling my name every time, bro. It was so embarrassing, bro. She just kept calling my name, Carja. I mean, mm -ha. Devin, 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 everywhere, bro. This shit was fucking mad annoying, bro. Staring at them like a psychopath. That's definitely gonna put them off, and it's it's just not gonna work out for you. You know what I'm saying? One of my favorite moves that I do lots of times, especially the whoever I think is like hella bad. Like if she's bad, I have to look back, which I'm pretty sure everyone does. this. like you'll look at a girl as she walks by, and once she's behind you, you turn around. You see what I'm saying to look at her again. Like I only do that on rare occasions because like you can't be giving nobody to look back. But in all seriousness, if anyone watching this got a legit hallway crush and it's someone you dead want to like pursue and get after like shoot your shot for real like like imagine you die tomorrow then what you ain't gonna be able to talk to them or holler at them because you're gonna be dead gang like you're gonna be in the ground so you know what i'm saying live your life go get after your hallway crush if you genuinely want that person because you never know what could happen and you might be saying like jace but i'm afraid of rejection or whatever if you do end up getting rejected just keep it pushing nah, just move on like there's other fish in the sea there's other people you know what i'm saying especially when it comes to a hallway crush you probably don't even know them like just keep it pushing it doesn't even matter bro and me personally i think about it, like everything happens for a reason you know so like if you get rejected then that person wasn't meant to be in your life you know what i'm saying bro chat bro i think when when is it bro chat it's i think i already told this story bro but i got rejected by my fucking girlfriend in ninth grade bro not great not great it was middle school nigga i got rejected by my girlfriend so that was just bad looks for me my nigga and pointing the homies shit was crazy she was crazy i bet she won't reject me now nigga i bet she'll be on my dick how about how much you want to bet if i test that same bitch she'll be on my dick right now so you just gotta keep it pushing. crazy. Yo, welcome to the end car. W video. This shit was a W video though. This shit was a.